Hey guys, happy Sunday. It's me again, Barry with Barry's A-Track and Classic Car Radio up here. And today we're going to be demonstrating another Techniques RS858 uh, quad uh, 2 slash 4 channel recording deck. And uh, we're just going to do a quick uh, final test, make sure everything's working before we send her back. Incidentally, this unit is from Jason in Highlands, New Jersey. I think this is the third or fourth job Jason has sent me. And there's no greater compliment uh, than... Uh, customers sending me more stuff to work on so uh thank you so much jason for your repeat business let's pop in some neil sadak and listen to this puppy play okay gonna switch tracks a bunch of times try to turn this thing so you can see stuff Okay, let's look at our output level meters, make sure we're getting uh, everything we're supposed to be getting. We'll turn down on the right. Turn down the left. Okay, now that's in stereo mode, of course. So let's eject this tape and let's pop in a quad tape. We got Danny Thomas in the Nashville Brass. And of course, the, on a quad tape, you're not going to get uh, output on all four sides at all times. That's one, of the, that's one of the ideas of surround sound is that some sounds aren't always there. So let's go ahead and pop this in. We've got to set this to four channel. Uh, most decks will automatically switch between two and four channel when you plug in a quad tape. The techniques is a little bit more flexible. Uh, you have to put it in four channel mode. Uh, so here we go. Alright, let's get some action going on here. Okay, switch tracks. That's a little loud for the system, I guess. Now you'll notice that left rear is pretty dead. And before long, some solo instrument will pop in on that channel. Now we only have four programs on a, on a quad tape, so uh, we're on program two. We punt it again, it's gonna bypass three and four and go back to one. Okay, now that we've seen all that cool stuff. Now we're on track two, and as we switch this, three, four, it bypasses three and four, goes back to one. Okay, and that's uh, that's pretty much it. There's not much to demonstrate on this uh, type of unit since it's not a radio or anything like that. So she's ready to go back. I'm ready to get on to the next job. I'm Barry with Barry's A-Track and Classic Car Radio Repair. And needless to say, if you have an A-Track player, either for home or for car use in need of service, you can reach me at 928-533-9666. I also do FM conversions on Classic Car AM radios with or without an A-Track. Uh, I actually can make them perform and sound better than they did when they rolled off the assembly line. Uh, so, uh, my website's in the description below. Thank you, Jason, for your repeat business, and thank you so much for watching listening to my customer base. Have a great day. I'll see you next time.